What is going on? My name is Abu and welcome to another video. In this lecture, I'm going to teach you how to mark up and style list of multiple terms and their definitions like this. As you can see, every term itself is in bold text style and its definition has a normal text style with a nice indentation on the left. If this is your first time here and you want to develop your skills in HTML, CSS and JavaScript from the ground up to the expert level, start now by subscribing and clicking the bell so you don't miss anything. Here on the left I opened up the HTML document I created for this lecture using Visual Studio Code and on the right I opened up the same HTML document with Google Chrome. Starting from line 19 I have three terms with their definitions. Starting from algorithm, API and browser as the last one and they have their definitions on the following line. As you can see, currently they display like a normal text block, one after another, and it's a bit hard to know which part is term and which part is definition. In order to display them properly, first we need to wrap all three of them using HTML description list tag like this. The opening description list tag looks like this, starting with left angle bracket, the L and right angle bracket. And a closing description list tag looks like this, starting with left angle bracket, forward slash DL and right angle bracket. After that we need to mark up every term with description term tag like this. The opening description term tag looks like this starting with left angle bracket DT and right angle bracket. And a closing description term tag looks like this starting with left angle bracket forward slash DT and right angle bracket. Opening description term tag here and the closing description term tag here. Opening description term tag here and the closing description term tag here. And now we need to mark up every term definition with description details tag like this. The opening description details tag looks like this starting with left angle bracket, DD and right angle bracket. And a closing description details tag looks like this, starting with left angle bracket, forward slash, dd, and right angle bracket. Opening description details tag here, and closing description details tag here. Opening description details tag here, and closing description details tag here. Now I'm going to save this and let's see how they look. Okay, it worked. As you can see, every term and its definition started from a new line and also there's a nice indentation before every definition block. That is how browsers render a list of terms and definitions marked up with description list tag, description term tag and description details tag. But we can make them look better by applying a little text style to the definition term text. So let's do that. So inside the head tag, I'll create a style tag. The opening style tag looks like this, starting with left angle bracket, style and right angle bracket. And the closing style tag looks like this, starting with left angle bracket, forward slash, style and right angle bracket. I'll also add type attribute on the opening style tag like this, type and its value is text forward slash CSS. Now let's write some CSS codes inside the style tag. First I'll select the description term tag DT and a space and after that I'll open up a curly brace. Inside here I'll declare a style property called font weight colon and its value is bold and semicolon. So this block of CSS codes will tell the browser that find the description term tag and apply bold text style to its contents. By the way, if you want to learn more about when and how to use HTML style tag, please make sure to check out my another lecture about HTML style tag. You can find the link in the description below. Now I'm going to save this and let's see how they look. Okay, it worked. As you can see, every definition term is displaying as a bold text. Now it's really easy to find out which is term and which is definition. 
If you started learning HTML and you want to master when and how to use every different HTML tag, make sure you check out this playlist and it has everything you need to master different HTML tags. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.